Hello Taurus, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on your love life. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notifications bell. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at the TarotEmpress.com. Okay, so what I'm seeing from the cards is there's a sense of sadness connected to a situation that you could be feeling stuck in. There's a sense of sadness connected to a situation that has left you feeling trapped, limited, and you know, you basically feel like you can't make a move under these circumstances. And this is a difficult energy. It really is a very difficult energy. It's combined with two forces. One that is referring to mental anguish, the other that it's referring to emotional heartache and pain. It's like someone looking upon a situation and feeling a sense of emptiness, a sense of loss, a sense of despair. So let's clarify that energy. So what I see here from this situation is that there's a lot of pain connected to the relationship that you're currently involved with. I feel like someone is struggling to see what's really going on. It feels as if they're ignorant and they're not listening. They're not paying attention, right? And there's also the silence. There's this absence of communication that is happening right now. Perhaps there's certain things you're not saying. Perhaps there's certain things this individual is not saying. I feel like this has happened as a result of certain events. Certain events have shaped the situation in the manner that it is. What I'm also sensing from the cards is that there was some sort of uh, awakening that occurred in the past 
Someone began to see things in a different manner, but they weren't saying things. It's like this individual's eyes was opening or your eyes were opening in the course of the situation. And the reality of it all, the reality of this entire situation, it struck a chord that made this individual go into this different place, drift into this different world. And it wasn't easy. It's a painful sort of escape, right? Because I see that as a result of that epiphany or whatever they were going through, it, it brought to light a lot of pain, grief and sadness that comes from a different place. It might not have arise as a result of your actions. It may have come as a result of certain experiences, right? Maybe someone was hesitating to make a decision. Someone was holding back to say something or do something in terms of the situation. It feels as if, you know, all of this was occurring and an individual in the situation was just observing and realizing that they're not being heard, their voice is being obstructed, then, you know, what they have to say, what they're expressing, no one is listening. And so they went into this different sort of place inside of their head. I'm seeing that things are falling apart. Things have to change. Someone has become very, very focused, right, on winning, on moving forward regardless of this difficulty. So where does this leave this love connection with you, right? Because I'm picking up some very hard energies here, some very, very difficult energies that can present obstacles later down the line, even though you may not see it right now. And it's important to look more closely. I'm seeing that from the cards, right? There's this flow of information, a flow of information that is occurring between you and this individual. And it might be, might be subconscious. It might not even be something that you can actually see or feel right now. It's like there are certain things that are going on between you and this individual and it's without words. It's rather limiting because I feel like you feel this expansion that is going on, right? And you don't know what to do with it. It feels as if you are, you know, stuck in this moment of time. You're trying to look forward towards, you know, what's coming ahead. And it feels as if right now there's very little actions being taken because one individual in particular doesn't know which is the right action to partake in in relation to the situation, right? So that's making it even more difficult. A lot of grief, a lot of sadness, right? Someone is feeling enormously stuck, enormously stuck in a situation in which um, they want things to change. They want things to change in this rapid sort of manner. And it's incredibly important for this to occur, right? 
So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these cards on an extended reading. You can find the links in the description box below. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.